Chelmsford Junction's top 10 model shops. Roll the intros. <laughs> And welcome back to Chelmsford Junction. I'm Peter. Today, as the title suggests, this is my top 10 model shops. Now, this is not just internet based, it's model shops that are local to me as well. So, I'm just going to give you, they're not in a specific order, but I will give a top three model shops that are my favourite. Number 10, I would put eBay. Because if you can't find it in any of your model shops and you can't find it anywhere on the web, it's more than likely you may find it on eBay. Now, you could either buy these products brand new, they could be second hand, it could be a part, it could be you know, anything from a piece of track to a bag of ballast, it could be from N scale, it could be double O scale, it could be o, scale, o gauge, G gauge, gauge one, it could be any scale. So if you can't find it in a model shop and you can't find it local to you, you can't find it on the internet, try eBay. That's my top, that's my, my, my number 10. I would like to say that these are not in order, I'm just reading them off. Number nine, Metcalf. If you are a lover of your card kits, Metcalf is my, personally my preference my place to go they have an absolute excellent range for n-gauge and double o-gauge the car kits are easy to understand they're made of good quality materials they come with absolute brilliant instructions and if you do have a problem or if there's a just one single piece missing or like i've had in the past i had a window set um i think it was uh, in one of my houses, uh, one of my house unit, one of my house packs, there was the wrong windows. Just give Metcalf a ring and free of charge, they will send you out that specific item free of charge. So at number nine, I will give Metcalf. At number eight, local model shop to me is Tenant's Trains. It's about half an hour's drive away from me. Um, I forget roughly where it is in Birmingham. Uh, it's just off the M4. Five, I think Junction 2 or 3, if I remember rightly. Don't quote me on that. Um, he's one of those places where he's a little bit of a gold mine. If you go in there, you may find something that you wasn't looking for, but you go, ah, what a brilliant idea. I could use that. He is on uh, the internet. You can actually order from the internet. I think you, he does part, send things out in, in the mail. So obviously you've got... Um, your, your choice of having it sent out to you or you can click and collect or you can at the moment because obviously we've now just come out of the lockdown you can go down there and possibly have a look depending on what the tier what tier they are in at the moment I think they are in tier three the same as I am in Birmingham but again that's number eight number ten that's tenant trains number seven now this company is absolutely brilliant. This is Scale Model Scenery. Now, we have just had the Warley virtual events uh, last weekend, if I remember right. Um, and these guys were on the Warley event showing you some of their new products and telling us what products are on their way to us. Now, I have actually got quite a few of their products uh, in my station area. I've got the... Um, Catch pits along the track sides. Uh, I've got the, uh, if I remember rightly, the AWS relay box stations. I've got a few other kits of theirs. I've got their signs, uh, that the uh, rail speed signs. They are in, they scale in N gauge and double O, and I do believe they are starting to look at O gauge as well. So that is scale model scenery. Uh, the proprietor there, I think, is Justin. Very, very nice man. Very, very approachable. So when we do get our exhibitions back, if you ever see Justin and you've got a question for him, go up to him. He's very approachable. Very nice man. And he remembers exactly what you asked or said that you would like to see. So that is Scale Model Scenery at number seven. 
Number six is Kite's Lights. Now, this gentleman, I forget what his name is. He is based on the Isle of Wight. And he specializes in um, street, lamp, street lights, basically. Anything from your street lights to yard lamps to platform lighting, uh, street lighting, road lighting, vending machines. You name it, this gentleman, if it's if it's illuminated, this gentleman has probably done it. He is very approachable. Again, I have spent him at a couple of events. Um, well, last time I saw him was at uh, Warley last year, which is 2019, obviously, because we didn't have one R1 this year. Um, if you order from him, he usually says, oh, give it a week with the post. I've ordered from him over during the COVID in uh, during the COVID situation, sorry guys, no editing. Uh, he's told me, you know, it could be a week for delivery. I've had it in less than two days, and that's from the Isle of Wight. So what you've got to remember is that's got to go in the post box, collected by Royal Mail, over on a ferry, then into a main sorting office, and then sent out to the rest of the UK. So two days, that is really, really good customer service. I would highly recommend him. He is on the internet. You can order on the internet, and you also can phone him and order from him on the phone uh, he takes all major bank cards and i do believe he also takes paypal i think but don't quote me on that and i think he may have a ebay page but again don't quote me on that double check he may have an ebay page and he may accept paypal but again double check that's at number six kite slides number five is kerno model railway center now i hope i've pronounced that right they are based in Cornwall. Now, the reason I like Kerno is they get a lot of exclusives, uh, Backman exclusives, Daypole exclusives. I know they do exclusives from Hellian or Helljam, which however you pronounce them. These are usually limited edition runs. Um, I already have one uh, 150 unit from them themselves, and I am looking at a couple more from them. Again, they are on the internet. I will leave, hopefully, a link to their website down below in, in the uh, comment section, in the description section, sorry. Um, again, like I said, they're on the internet. You can phone them up. You can order either online or via the phone. Again, they are very, very approachable. If you have a question for them, they are very knowledgeable and they're a very nice team, excellent customer service. I would highly recommend them. So that is at number five, Kerno Model Railway Centre. Number four, Rails of Sheffield. I've had some really, really good customer service from Rails of Sheffield. They are one of the big players on the internet. Uh, I've ordered, recently in the past year, I ordered a new release from Daypole, which was the Daypole uh, water tower, which was automated. You press the button, the arm would come out towards the train it would play a load of sounds but unfortunately Daple had to recall them Rails of Sheffield were straight away emailing me we need this item back there is a problem it causes a fire it can melt it could cause a fire so immediately I responded to Rails of Sheffield phoned them up asked them what the problem was exactly heard what they had to say and I said okay I will send it straight back they sent me a link in my emails which was a free post link. They just literally a label that I could print out on my printer, put it back on the box that it came in, and it was free postage back to Rails of Sheffield. Again, they get a lot of exclusives, a lot of limited editions. If they haven't got a product that you need or want, they can usually put it on back order for you, and they will let you know when it's in, so you can actually pay for it, and they will send it out. Also, if they can't answer a question, not many people or not many model shops will be able to answer your question. So number four, that is Rails Sheffield. Uh, number three is Hattons. Now, we all know Jack and Dave from Hattons. I have had quite a few conversations with the customer services manager, Harriet, there. Uh, the team are always helpful. Again, you can order online. You can order on the phone. If you have a problem, they will be gladly there to help you sort that problem out. If they can't sort it out over the phone, you can send the item back to them. If it's a fault with the item, they will send you out another one. Or they can re 
you know, reimburse your money back to you. Like I said, they are again, like Ship Rails of Sheffield, a massive, massive company happens are. They have a massive work, uh, work area and warehouse down in Liverpool area. I haven't been there yet myself, obviously due to COVID-19. I was planning to go there this year, but obviously I was unable to. So hopefully, fingers crossed, next year I will be making a trip to Liverpool and making a trip to Hattons. So that is at my number three. At number two is Mike's Models. Now Mike's Models is of Junction 7 of the M6. It's about 10, 15 minute uh, drive from the Junction 7 of the M6. It's one of those places where he doesn't just do model railways, he does uh, radio control aircraft, radio control cars, drones, radio control boats. If you can't find an item to help you scratch builds, anything in the RC industry or in the model industry that you're doing, either RC, model railways, airfix, things like that, if you can't find an item to help you build what you're building, you will not find it anywhere else. Mike's Models is an absolute treasure trove of little pieces that you will not normally find in the bigger places like Rails of Sheffield and Hattons. These, this, this, this company really, really do go to the extra mile and get the extra tiny little things or the extra big things that you guys need to finish off what you're modeling. So that is Mike's Models at number two. My top number one model shop is Tony's Trains of Tony's Trains of Rugby. Tony is a one-man band. He works on his own. He has employed a gentleman who works for him part-time. I myself have actually helped him once or twice uh, on a voluntary basis and done a few bits and pieces with him to clear the back cupboard up to make things a bit better. He's got a massive, massive range of brand new products from Hornby, Backman, Daypole, He's even got Hattons, he's got EFE, Helian, he does everything from N-Gage to double O, O-Gage. He's got Wooden Scene, all of the Wooden Scenics range. He's got a lot of the um, Oxford uh, cars. You've got anything you can think of. Tony has got it. If he hasn't got it, he will gladly order it for you, get it in, and once he's got it in, He'll give you a ring, say, right, I've got your item in. You can go down there, pay for it, and take it home with you. Why is Tony my number one? He is localish to me. He's only about 20 minutes down the road on the M6. I live at Junction 4, and he is on Junction 1. So it's a quick 20-minute jaunt down the M6. It's in a lovely little area. And it's in the middle of the countryside. You've got a lovely canal that you can walk along alongside. If it's a nice sunny day, there's also a refreshment stand there that's open as well, where you can buy cups of tea, coffee, cans of Coke, things like that. It's a nice little place to go down there, have a look in Tony's model shop, grab your items on a nice sunny day, go sit at the canal. And not only can you see the barges going up and down the canal, there's also the viaduct in the distance. And on the viaduct, you will see majority of the west coast mainline services from london going towards scotland and there's always something going across there whether it be from a pendolino to a class 350 even freight workings go across that viaduct so again tony strange is my number one shop i would highly recommend him again all the shops that i've mentioned i will try and leave a link down below in the descriptions I hope you've enjoyed this video guys. I've enjoyed putting this little no this little selection together for you. I've actually had to rack my brains and think who are my favourite shops. I know some people out there may think that I've picked certain shops at a higher end of the of the range of the of the top ten more than I should have done, but it's my opinion, it's my top ten and I would highly recommend that you look at look at all the top tens. Got all of the all of the uh, individuals in the top ten, because you never know. One of them or two, three of them might be able to help you 
get a piece that you're missing for your model railway or if like like i said with mike's models if you're into radio control boats or planes they might have the item that you're looking for so like i said guys that is my top 10. i hope you've enjoyed the video if you have please hit the like button it'd be appreciated if you are a subscriber thumbs up thank you very much and thank you for the new subscribers that have come on board recently if you aren't a subscriber hit the subscribe button and you can stay tuned and find out when i put more videos on to my channel and i hope that when you, the people that have come on board recently i hope you're enjoying the content from my channel if you want to carry on watching videos from my channel there should be a link coming up here and a link coming up here until the next time guys stay safe look after yourselves but above all happily mo happy modeling and bye bye for now